gable. This is going to be our Archicad tip of the week. Uh, trimming to create a cross gable roof. If you've not done this before, what you do is you create two roofs, two gable roofs, and then intersect with each other. And so if we want to trim them, as you can see, when you, inter you, know, when you have two roofs going through each other, they're not trimming by default. They're actually going right through each other, as you can see with these two, right? So we've got to trim them in order for uh, this to appear as uh, a ceiling uh, that's, that's connecting inside and doesn't have two roofs going through it. So first thing we want to do is to show our trimming bodies. That's what you see right here. This kind of helps us a little bit see what's going on. If you've not used this before, you can go to your view menu, on-screen view options, and go to trimming bodies. And that will then show our uh, trimming bodies in terms of how it's being trimmed. So what you want to do is to select both roofs, and then from the, con the context menu, basically right-click and just go to connect, and go select trim elements to roof shell. Pretty easy. And then say use roof shell from current selection. So that's then going to trim both of these to each other. And that works pretty well. The only thing is that it doesn't quite trim at all. So as you can see here, there's still a little bit of a roof coming down through here, right? And, and so that is because, um, depending upon how you're actually selecting the, um, uh, the trimming body uh, option in the uh, roof settings. So if you open up the roof settings under the model panel, okay, there's an option here called uh, contours down or pivot lines down. So what you're seeing in this particular one, and again, it just depends on how your settings are set in your default. But in the um, uh, uh, roof settings here, you'll see that the pivot lines um, are, or in this case, it's, it's set to pivot lines down. So what that means is that it's trimming from the pivot line, not from the edge of the roof, okay? So that's what contour lines down means. It means it's going to draw it all the way from the edge of the contour, which is the edge of the roof, okay, which is what it's doing here. And that's really what you want. You want to actually select contours down and then do a, and retrim that so that it actually is trimming appropriately uh, throughout the entire roof. Otherwise, you'll end up with little pieces like this where it trimmed from the trimming body, I'm sorry, from the pivot lines and not from the contours. And then you'll end up with a nice trimmed uh, roof that shows the interior as you would expect. And that is our tip of the week.